In this video we will explore the HTTP 2 DDoS Vulnerability Rapid Reset CVE 2023-44487. Today, we will take a deep dive into CVE 2023-44487, also known as Rapid Reset. We will explore the nature of the vulnerability and provide at the end two scripts and how to monitor the vulnerability results. HTTP 2 is a protocol that revolutionized web communication, but it also introduced new vulnerabilities that we need to be aware of. In this video, we will explore the risks involved with HTTP 2 and specifically focus on CVE 2023-44487, a critical vulnerability that you should know about. To stay informed about the latest vulnerabilities, it's crucial to keep an eye on vendor advisories and security updates. Why is HTTP2 not widely used? Compatibility issues, older systems and browsers may not support HTTP2, making it less appealing for websites that cater to a broad audience. Lack of awareness, many website owners are not fully aware of the benefits that HTTP2 can bring, leading to slower adoption rates. Server updates, transitioning to HTTP2 often requires updates to web servers, which some organizations may find cumbersome or risky. Recent DDoS attacks have exploited the CVE 2023-44487 vulnerability, reaching an astonishing 201 million requests per second. The scale of these attacks is truly alarming. In the image, you can see Google mitigated DDoS attack that peaked at 398 million requests. The DDoS attacking IP address are performed by a series of botnets that drop the IP address very quickly as you can see form the diagram, Cloudflare IP block list. Mitigation strategies are essential to protect your systems from HTTP 2 vulnerabilities. We will discuss effective ways to mitigate the risks. Despite its advantages, HTTP 2 adoption is not as widespread as expected. We will explore the reasons behind this and shed light on the transition from HTTP 1.1 to HTTP 2. In conclusion, understanding HTTP 2 vulnerabilities is crucial in today's cybersecurity landscape. At Phoenix Security, we can help identify and address these vulnerabilities in your systems.